Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unique Tutorials. Today in this video, I will show you how to get virtual CD or DVD drive in any Windows computer. So without any further more delay, let's begin. So first let me show you by going to this PC. Here you can see a hardware physical DVD drive that I have in my Windows computer. So this is a hardware physical drive as you can see DVD rw drive this is a dvd drive so how you can get a virtual cd or dvd drive exactly like this so for this what you need to do is you need to open any web browser and you need to visit to this website i'll be providing this website link to in the video description so you can click here and visit to this website once you visit to this website you can see a software or application name as virtual clone drive so here you can see it's clearly mentioned virtual clone drive works and behaves just like a physical CD, DVD or Blu-ray drives. So what you can do, just click on the download. So let it get downloaded. So here you can see some more features, the files that it supports. It can open ISO, bin, image, DVD and CD files. So you can see here some more. So let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded so let me minimize this just double left click it to run the installer just click on I agree you can select all the options if you want I'll just keep it as it is click install wait for a few seconds until the installation gets complete so the installation is completed just click on close so here you can see on the left side the icon of the newly installed software named as virtual clone drive so let's try to open it by double left clicking so you can see here you can see this kind of interference right you can increase the drives also so you can see if you want a huge number of drives then you can increase the number of drives you can turn on or turn off this option say it's showing show tray icon so you can see on the right bottom you can see here a tray icon for the application virtual clone drive so let's move to this pc and let us check how many drives it creates so you can see here it has created one drive so this one is the virtual drive this is the original dvd or cd drive and this is the virtual cd or dvd drive so you can see here it's created so here the number of drives is one so let's try to increase it to and click OK so you can see it increased it created two more virtual CD or DVD trap so you can see here so let's try to make it one again so click OK so it's one and if you want to remove this just what you can do just open the virtual drive again and just select this and just click on disable click on OK it will get removed so in this way you can get a virtual CD or DVD drive in any Windows computer totally for free. So let us do it in practical purpose. So let me enable it again one. So what you can do when you open this kind of ISO files as you can see on the left side just right click and you can see here open with so you can see here mount files with virtual clone drive so let's try to mount it so you can see it's mounted so you can use like a CD or DVD drive this virtual clone drive so we'll just try to right click and we'll just try to ease it again so it works exactly like the physical CD or DVD drive so if you never known about this cool application then try it out today and if you find this video tutorial useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching